Hi Libra, this is Nayla Latrice. I am here to do a read for you all for the month of March. Let's jump right on in. Spirit, what messages do you have for Libra for the month of March? Wow, you are coming out in your own energy, Libra. We have the Queen of Wands that is here um, for you. And what I'm picking up on, uh, what I am picking up for you right now is that you are in your power. I feel like you have a lot of creative endeavors um, that's going on for you at this time. We also have the Five of Pentacles. Uh, so I feel like right now you are working on different creative projects for yourself i feel like you many of you guys are um, entrepreneurs or business owners or you guys are taking some type of new leap of faith when it comes to your career i feel like um of course, with everything that has been happening on globally, uh, it has caused a lot of people to have to pivot and, and think different when it comes to their career. And I feel like right now you have uh, you are discovering or you have discovered what it is you want to do moving forward, whether this is in uh, the corporate field, whether this is uh, as an entrepreneur, uh, owning your own business, a creative endeavor, a singing, artwork, whatever the case may be, opening up a salon, um, moving up in the corporate ladder, applying for that promotion. I feel that is what you are focused on in this month of March right now, Libra. I feel like what it is that you are asking for, you will be receiving as long as you put the work in. I do feel like your finances are not exactly what you where you are used to having them. And that is what is triggering you and motivating you to move forward in this new career endeavor, okay? I do feel like your finances may not be the best right now, but Spirit is saying they will improve so do not worry i also feel like you have a connection with animals some of you guys or a connection with um uh, some type of spirit animal or there's some type of message for you from an animal um uh, uh so maybe spend some time uh, in nature or if you have uh some type of animal um cats dogs whatever to spend time with these animals because they are going to help heal you or help you to feel better but i do feel like you have the support around you whether you see it or not for your finances so um things are going to be coming in last minute possibly where you feel like oh my gosh i may not be able to pay this bill there's going to be things that come in um at the last minute to assist you and help you so everything is going to work out for you even down to the last minute if it doesn't feel like it so continue to have faith okay during the month of uh, march then we have the three of cups news worth celebrating joyful announcements like engagements weddings pregnancy or graduation a time for gratitude close communities or chosen family so again keep moving forward because what you're doing it will be paying off for you you will be celebrating very soon i also pick up on the energy of somebody wanting to connect with you somebody is wanting to collab with you um and this is also what could be helping you to um allow your finances to get better okay but i do feel the energy of um a lot of work energy here, a lot of financial energy here, but I do feel like everything that you are working on right now, it is going to bless you and it is setting you up for your future, okay? Let's get one more out. Oh, 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 we have too many. Bear, what messages do you have for Libra for the month of March? What messages do you have for Libras for the month of March? All right, we have... We have the emperor. Spirit is telling you to boss up during this time. I also feel like this person that wants to connect with you, it could be a boss figure or it could be somebody, uh, it's an authoritative figure. They want to help you. They're coming into your life to help you. Um, it also could be a romantic partner as well. Uh, nonetheless, this person is coming into your life to help you. So if you feel like things are not going your way during the month of March, just continue to be patient and hold out. You will be meeting someone that will be very impactful on your
your journey, okay? And they're going to come in and give you the resources that you need. They're going to come in and give you the love that you need, possibly. Um, and do know that you love on yourself first. So when I say the love that you need, meaning that um, the love that you desire and that you um, that you have been waiting on or that you want to receive, okay? Um, but I do feel um, this person is a boss. This person is somebody that does not play around. They do not play any games. This person could be a little bit intimidating as well. Um, I do feel you are able to keep up with them. They have their eye on you for a reason. Again, this could be a boss figure. Um, you could be doing very, very well at work. Um, somebody could be watching you build a business. Um, but whatever the case may be, you have someone, an energy that wants to enter into your life to assist you and to help you to move to the next level, okay? Um, we do have the page of cups here at the bottom of the deck for you. Yes, this person is coming in to balance things out, to balance your life out. I'm also feeling that you should uh, balance out your masculine and feminine energies. Uh, focus on uh, manifesting with the moon cycles, okay? Um, Whatever is coming in is going to set you up for stability. You are going to be very stable very soon. Continue to work throughout the month of March to balance out your energy, to work on your to accept this help that is coming in and to just kind of overall plan what your future is going to be um, and what it's going to look like after the month of March because you have a lot of shifts and a lot of transformation that is happening for you and these shifts and these energies that are exchanging and taking place they are coming into your life to help you to build um, the type of life that you really want it is helping you to build um, finances and have a, 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 have a great fight a great foundational setup for you and your family again you have a wish fulfillment that is here with this nine of cups something that you've been asking for something that you have been praying for something that you have been working for and manifesting it is going to be on its way to you very soon again i feel to to manifest that um spirit is saying to work on manifesting with the moon that is how you manifest with the moon and also balancing out your male and female energies that is the most important advice i could give to you in regards to manifesting okay that's one of those small little secrets that people don't necessarily say yes you're going to be holding on to something or somebody is holding on to you but i feel like um uh, with this that you are holding on to yourself you are holding on to your pride you're holding on to your dignity you know that you have been through a lot recently and you are just i feel with this four of pentacles you are taking time for you and you are spending or um you are saving money to be able to spend on yourself because you want to be able to invest in you and give back to yourself there's something that you are holding near and dear to your heart something that is very valuable something that is very important to you and uh you're you're very serious about whatever this is okay um but whatever it is it is bringing you a lot of happiness and joy yeah you're protecting your heart you're protecting yourself with this nine of wands energy at the bottom of the deck again you have been through a lot of trials and tribulations and now you're in the energy of being able to really set yourself up for your future especially career-wise and financially okay a lot of great things happening for you in your career um and in your fi finances so for the romance angels the first we have out is playfulness so this person that will be coming into your life spirit wants you to be very playful with them but i feel spirit is asking you to get more in this playful energy versus this nine of wands energy balance out your male and or your masculine and feminine energies i feel like even if you are a female you're in this masculine energy you're in this protective uh, energy like um you're not gonna just walk across my fence i'm going to uh i'm guarding my space i'm guarding myself and although that is okay for you to protect yourself don't do it so much to where you are so serious and people um cannot be playful with you but I do feel for you, Libra, you guys are playful people anyways and fun and energetically. So Spirit is just telling you to tap into that energy. Um, and that is what is going to attract somebody towards you and also um, bring who you want toward to you. <laughs> For some of you guys, you guys will be reconciling with someone. I know this is all about brand new energy, but Spirit is saying there, for some of you, there is a relationship where you guys will be reconciling, and it's so strong that it wanted to come out in the read within all of this new energy, okay? So, um, and the, a lot of this new energy is more so for your for your um, work and your career finances. So when it does come to more specifically love, there is an energy of someone wanting to reconcile with you, whether you take them back 
back or not is up to you, uh, Libra. But there is someone that wants to be playful with you. They want a brand new start. They want to show you a different side of them. So if you are willing to reconcile with this person, uh, pay attention to their actions more than you do their words, okay? Because somebody can uh, be slick as a can of oil and try to talk their way back to you, but their actions are not um, showing up and matching what their words are saying. And then we have getting to know each other. So this person wants to get to know you all over again or this new person that is coming towards you. You guys will be spending a lot of time getting to know one another. And then we have heart-to-heart -heart conversation. So for many of you guys, this could be somebody from the past that is returning to you guys and you guys are going to have a lot of different conversations um, about um, how to move forward from the past on how to not make the same mistakes you guys did in the relationship when you guys were in it before and how to just be... Um how to again get to know each other over again uh maybe since uh you guys were together previously their favorite color was blue and now it's changed to violet i don't know but you guys are going to get to know each other all over again if you are reconciling with this person so do not assume that you know this person because people change every day b all right, so let's see. We have nothing is yet set in stone. Again, this person, this is in regards to this person that wants to come back around to you. Uh, they feel like they have a chance with you still. And Spirit is saying nothing is yet is set in stone. So there is a chance that you are able to make it work with this person if both of you guys are putting in the work, okay? Then we have meditate and contemplate. So whatever it is you're thinking about, whatever decisions that you have to make during this month of March, make sure that you are actually taking the time out to think about the best decision that is for you and your family moving forward. And then we have you and your loved ones are safe. A lot of people are getting this card. I feel like there's a lot of fear in the air just overall, but it's all an illusion. So break through that illusion and that cycle of fear. You are safe and you are protected. Spirit is asking you to believe in the impossible during the month of March. Believe that you can have whatever it is that you desire and know that you have the power to will it into existence okay so the two cards we have out for you is financial constraints look look at what we had financial constraints and this five of pentacles, like I said, many of you guys, your money is not where it used to be. But look and behold the last card out. Even though you are having financial constraints, spirit is saying, don't fret. You have somebody coming in or you have an energy coming in. You have opportunities. You have resources. You have connections. Something is coming in to make everything better for you in your life and during the month of March. So even if it comes down to the last minute, do know that we are going into spring and the sun will be coming out for you, Libra. Everything is working in your favor, especially with your finances. Speak it over your life. I am going to leave your read here, Libra. Do not forget to comment below and let me know how it resonates. Um, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Until next time, bye Libra.